Bimkanaya Nugan, Ejinim Naya, Lak Umnan Mege, Bomo Gala Apayan, Inilama Imi Amka Anga, Memgam Gangi, Nina Geguan, Amnerna Hanak. That's excellent news. Mem Ilik Meraka, Nayanaram, Kam Kalu Amik Manik, Manalayang Perlu, Amka Kalami Naya Kira Nubua. Excuse me. Yes, could I speak with you for a moment? I don't mean to trouble you, Jedi, but I'm curious if anyone from the ship's crew has come to speak with you yet. I haven't spoken to any members of the crew, but anyone who needs the help of the Jedi will have it. Thank you. I'm glad to hear that. I heard a rumor that there's an Imperial warship following us. I know, I know. The Treaty of Coruscant. But I don't trust the Empire to keep the peace. We should always be on our guard against the evils of the Sith. It's good to hear I'm not the only one concerned about the Imperials. The crew won't tell the passengers anything at all. It's not very reassuring. If we're in danger, the crew has a responsibility to tell us. Exactly. At least then we could repair in case of an attack. Can you hear me? Are you all right? The Imperials seem to have forgotten about the treaty. I knew the treaty would break eventually, but I didn't think I'd actually be here to see it. Listen, you have to get to the bridge. The captain will need all of the help he can get right now. Go, hurry. Let's just hope it's not too late to help. It's never too late to try. Good luck. Come on, Tyrus. You can make it, sir. You can make it. He's gone, sir. You're in charge now. What are our orders? Your orders? Weapons are out! Shields are out! Comms are out! There's nothing we can do! The path may not always be clear, but that doesn't mean there is no path. Why is this Jedi standing on our bridge spouting nonsense? We're in a situation here! Sir, we need all the help we can get. If we don't keep it together here, we're finished. Keep what together? The Imperials have us by the throat! We're as good as dead already! That's really not helping things right now. I just can't believe this is happening. Sir, incoming message. The Imperial ship is hailing us. What? Oh. Well then put them on. Republic Transport Esselus, this is Grand Moff Rikus Kilrin. Your defenses are entirely disabled. Attempt no resistance. We're aware of our situation, Kilrin. Just tell us why you're here. Your ship is transporting a known anti-imperial terrorist and seditionist, the so-called Ambassador Vin Asara. I've come to collect her. Who? We didn't take any passengers by that name. I've never even heard of this person. <laughs> Interesting. Lying or incompetent, no matter. My agents aboard your ship have confirmed the Ambassador is there. You have spies aboard our ship? I have eyes everywhere. Imperial soldiers are preparing to board your ship through its primary airlock. My agents will ensure that you do not interfere with them. If you attempt to stop my men from arresting Ambassador Asara, I will have every living thing aboard the Esselus killed. Where is the primary airlock? I'll stop the Imperials as they try to board. Weren't you listening? If we try to fight those slaughterers, we have to cooperate! It won't matter. Kilrin has us now. He'll kill us all. He's famous for it. The only one he wants alive is the Ambassador. If Kilrin gets the Ambassador while we're sitting in his sights, we're goners. Those soldiers have to be stopped before they can succeed. I'm glad we're all on the same page here. Listen, I'm sorry I lost it earlier. It means a lot to have your help right now. Thank you. A Jedi's limits must always be put to the test. I'm sure you're up to anything the imps can throw at us. I'll have our security team meet you by the primary airlock. They haven't seen much action, but Commander Narlock knows his stuff. Good luck. We're all counting on you. This is it, men. 
This is what you've been training for. The Imperials are coming, and we're not gonna let them pass, are we? Sir, no, sir! We won't be fighting alone. We have some very experienced volunteers. The Imps will never know what hit them. Let's get to it, shall we? Yes, the battle plan. The Imps will cut through any second now. We need to take up defensive positions. Victory or nothing! Victory or nothing! Great! You have to hurry! It was all a trap! The Imperials set us up! Yes, Ambassador! Have to hurt all talk! Saved. I'm sorry, Commander, but that... that isn't the case. That Imperial said that you're the one they were sent to capture. Listen, that's not important right now. We have a serious problem. First Officer Hawken walked us right into a trap. The attack on this airlock was a ruse. After Hawken sent you here, Imperial Commandos snuck aboard. They were led by a Mandalorian mercenary called Iron Fist. We defeated the first group of boarders. There's no reason we can't defeat this group, too. It gets worse, I'm afraid. Iron Fist and his Imperial Commando stormed the bridge, and now the entire area is locked down tight. We have to stop the Imperials from gaining control of the ship. That's why I rushed to find you. Something has to be done. What is this all about? Why are the Imperials so desperate to capture you? Because of my work. I'm a Republic Ambassador. I travel to Imperial-controlled planets and convince their governments to come over to our side. Confronting the Empire for the sake of diplomacy takes a lot of courage. I'm no hero. I just show them an alternative to Imperial control. But we can talk about my work later. We need to retake the bridge. The longer we leave the Imperials in control, the harder it'll be to remove them. I already told you, Iron Fist has the bridge locked down. There's no way in or out. Security lockdown. That is bad. Chief Engineer Salen might know of a workaround. Hopefully we can get to Salen before the Imperials. Do you know where he is? He and his team will be down in the engineering section. I'm sure they'll be able to help us. We'll need a diversion. If the Imperials notice the hatches to engineering opening, they'll flood the area with soldiers. My men and I can handle that. Form up, men! We're gonna go start some trouble. Let's get that bridge open. We'll give those imps something to think about, won't we, boys? I'll go along with Commander Narlock. Once you've cleared a path to engineering, I'll double back and join up with you there. Good luck. Hey, hey Chief, come here. Come here, look. Look, there's someone out there on the other side of the door. You must be crazy coming all the way down here with the imps everywhere. Commander Narlock said that you might know of a way to unlock the bridge. The Imperials have it sealed off. The Imps pulled the lock down? You gotta be kidding me. You really cleared this place out. I didn't run into a single Imperial on my way down here. Listen, there's no time to waste. Commander Narlock and his men are being overrun. We have to get the bridge unlocked now. So I've heard. I'd invite you in, but the lockdown has our door sealed too. Are you going to be safe in there? Do you need help getting out? Getting the bridge back in our control is much more important. Now let's see. What about a reactor reset? That would disengage the locks, wouldn't it, sir? Yeah, but a reactor reset vents the engineering compartment. We'd be blown into space. Besides, controls are on the other side of the door. Tell your lackeys to shut up unless they have any ideas we can actually use. He was just trying to help. Besides, he gave me an idea. The secondary conduits. They're spread around a bit, but if you shut them all down, the security will go down too. Then we'll be in business. 
I'll get the conduit shut down right away. There's no time to go running all over the ship. If we don't act now, the Imperials will overwhelm us. I'm sorry, Salen. We need to unlock the bridge while we have the chance. We have to reset the reactor. You and your men will be remembered. We can't send these people to their deaths. Not when there's an alternative. Fine. But you're dooming everyone on this ship. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good. I make the decisions, Ambassador. Not you. Fine. Who am I to argue? You crazy witch! Shutting down the secondary conduits will work, I promise! If you're going to do it, go now. The longer you wait, the more Imperials you'll have after you. I don't know how you managed it, but you did. The security doors around the bridge have opened. The Force was with me, as usual. I don't know where I'd be if you hadn't been aboard. Probably locked in an Imperial prison, or worse. I'll go and help Narlock with another diversion, so you have as little resistance as possible when you attack the bridge. You'll still have to deal with Iron Fist, though, and that's no small challenge. What do you know about Iron Fist? I only know Iron Fist by reputation. But he's been doing Grand Moff Kilrin's dirty work for a long time now. He's never been captured, defeated, or even driven back. You have your work cut out for you. The Force will give me the strength I'll need. Just be careful. Mandalorians always have a few tricks up their sleeves. All right. No more time to waste. Narlock, are you there? Can you hear me? Copy! This is Narlock. Set for second offensive? That's right, Commander. I'm on my way to join you now. Let's hope Iron Fist isn't paying too much attention. Narlock and I will do our best to keep him distracted. Good luck. I was wondering when you'd finally show up. This is it? There aren't more of you? Just give up, Iron Fist. I don't want to have to hurt you or your men. Strange view of the situation. Guess you'd have to be a little crazy to put up the fight you have. Let's vape this worthless scum and get back to work. Officer Hawken, do you have any spare shuttles in the hangar bay? Spare shuttles? Yes, we do, but I don't... Then that's our only chance. You have to board Grand Moff Kilburn's ship and disable the tractor beam so that we can all escape. If this is what must be done to save the people on this ship, then I'll do it. I knew we could count on you. I've been aboard warships like Kilburn's. The tractor beam control should be easy to find if you know where you're going. Ambassador! You're familiar with the layout. Perhaps you should go along to help get the tractor beam shut down. Hmm. We need every advantage we can get. It will be good to have you along, Ambassador. I'll do my best to help in any way I can. Ambassador, before you go, take a spare uniform. We wouldn't want any Imperials to recognize you. Good thinking, Commander. Thank you. Now let's get moving. Good luck out there. We're all counting on you. Hey, hold up a minute. 
I need to talk to you before you go. I just talked to Salen from engineering. He told me what Asara tried to make you do down there. Thank you for stopping her. Sacrificing innocent people is wrong, no matter the reason. You stood up for the lives of my crew, and risked your own instead. I won't forget that. Listen, I've been thinking. I really believe this plan is going to work. But there's only one way to guarantee that we'll all make it home safe. And that's to make sure the Imperials have no reason to keep chasing us. You want me to hand the Ambassador over to the Imperials, don't you? Yes. For the sake of us all, I want you to leave Asara behind, on the Grand Moff ship. With the tractor beam down, we'll be able to escape, but Kilrin will just chase us down again. Unless he's already captured his target. As long as Asara is on this ship, everyone aboard is in danger. I don't know about you, but I'm tired of risking all of our lives for that woman. Don't let your anger at the Ambassador cloud your judgment. My judgment isn't clouded. This is what has to be done. I'm sure of it. Just think about it. I'd even make it worth your while if things go the way I'm suggesting. Anyway, you'd better get going. I've held you up too long already. Good luck. We have to hurry. I've seen some incredible things in my time, but you just topped the list. I'm sorry I couldn't greet you in person. If only you had let me know you were stopping by. Your taunts are useless. This won't stop until the Esselus is free. Are you certain me? I can only be cordial through so much. My men will be along shortly to escort you to the accommodations I've arranged. I guess this is where the fun begins. Iron Fist wasn't the only weapon in my arsenal, nor the deadliest. See you soon. I hope you realize that this is getting out of hand. You're leaving me with precious few options. Last, a real live Jedi. How I've looked forward to this. A true Sith cannot go long without a true challenge. You'll fall, like so many men before you. Death will never come for me. I am death. To destroy a dangerous foe, that is the way of a true Sith. When I carve your heart from your chest, your fellow Jedi will sense your defeat, as will my master. Your words are wasted. Let's finish this. You're right. Words are nothing without action. <laughs> Let's <laughs> go. 
charging up our main turbo lasers batteries. In a few moments, your pathetic ship and all your pathetic friends were nothing but floating debris. Come on, get onto the shuttles. We have to hurry. If we launch fast enough, I think we can make it. Are you ready? Right behind you, Ambassador. Let's just hope Hawken has the hyperdrive ready. Come on. Everyone's aboard, Plex. Get us out of here, now! We're safe! You did it! You did what no one else could have done. You've saved us all. We owe you our lives. Every one of us. So on behalf of the passengers and crew of the Republic Transport Esselus, thank you. Only doing what was right. There's no reason for modesty. What you accomplished here is truly amazing. I took up affection from everyone on the ship. Hopefully, these credits will help you save other people in need. The same way you saved us. You have my gratitude. You deserve far more. Ambassador Asara, it's... It's a relief to see that you made it back to us safely as well. It's a relief to be back, Hawken. I'm just glad that this is all finally over. We're finally safe. I want to thank you again for everything you've done. Heroes like you are hard to come by, and the Republic needs every one they can get. The Jedi will always be there to help those in need. Then the Republic is very fortunate to have your order for allies. I should warn you, though. Grand Moff Kilrun is never going to forget what we've done. He'll stop at nothing to get his revenge. If Kilrun thinks he can take us, he's in for a surprise. Just be sure to stay alert from now on. Kilrun is full of surprises. Anyway, enough of that. I'd say it's about time we all relaxed a bit and enjoyed the rest of our trip. Thanks again. And good luck in the future. <laughs>